Hey guys, Axertech here for another video tutorial for you guys. Uh, today I'm going to be covering something called File AI, which is a service that I found that lets you transfer files to friends, family, whoever you like, with no file restriction. So I'm going to go ahead and open up my internet browser and show you what it's all about. Alright, this is my new home page, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and type in uh, File AI into my Google search here. Let's go ahead and search for File AI, and the first link that comes up should be the one that you're looking for. So I'll go ahead and go here, and you can see this is the website here. So the first thing that you would do if you're going to send files, you're going to want to go ahead and send, uh, click the Send Files button. So we're going to go ahead and click that. And the first thing you'll notice is you get this big blue folder here. That blue folder lets you drop files, or you can actually click it and browse to a file. But I'm just going to drag a file on there to show you how it works. So I'm going to go to my desktop and get something pretty simple. I'll get a quick image for you. Drag that image right onto the folder, and you can see it creates your own transfer ID. So my ID is 630. Now if I wanted to send this to a friend, they have two ways to receive the files. They can either type in the website address here, or they can go to fileai.com, and we'll see what the number is, 630. So they can go to receive files, click already have a transfer ID to receive from, type in the ID that they got, And it's really just that simple, guys. Just browse to wherever you want to download the file to. And just like that, the download it starts. And it's already done. So you can see it's at 100% here. Um, you have the downloading number and the total downloaded. So basically what you're looking at here, on the end of the person who's actually downloading the file, they can see what the progress of the file transfer is at. So they can see how close they are to receiving the file. And then on the end of the user who's sending the file, they have their own little status bar here. You can see the IP address of the person who's downloading the file, the status, so if they're done or not. And then you can see what percentage they're at as well. So you both can see um, what the progress of the transfer is at. Uh, the nice thing about the site is that number one, as many people as you would like can be downloading the file from the same link at one time. So you can have 100 people or one person downloading the same file from the same site at the same time if you'd like. There's no file restriction. The only real limitation that I found with this website is that you do have to keep this tab open while you're doing the transfer until it is complete. Once it's complete you can exit out and then the transfer will no longer be valid. Um, however if you do exit out you will have to create a new link if you want to send the file again. Um, but other than that it's a really simple website to use. A uh, really nice uh, great features on it, I believe, and um, I've gotten quite use, quite a bit of use out of it, so hopefully you guys can get some use out of it as well. Um, let me get know what you guys think about the service. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video.